What is up, Wild Squad? Hope you're all doing well. In today's video, we're going to talk about a coin method that is not focused on zero chill. Now, a lot of times what I like to do with my coin methods is if there's not a really hot one going on right now at the current promo, is go and focus on something else because everybody is focusing on how to make coins off of zero chill and all that good stuff. And while there are a couple of good coin methods in there, there are still a lot of other ones that are profitable. We're going to talk about another set that's profitable. But before we do that, a quick word from our sponsor. Boys, if you're looking to add that brand new shiny player to your team in Madden, don't gamble with packs. Hit up Red Zone Coins for cheap, fast, reliable coins to help build your team. Use code WAS to get 20% off your order. And guys, as we're getting into this method, if you do want to build your coins back up, build the best team that you can in Mutt, don't forget to subscribe with the Nutty Bell on, because that is a lot about what we talk about on this channel. And guys, this is going to be one of those ones that when you watch this video, if you watch it right when it comes out, yes, you're going to be able to do the players that we talk about in this set and make some coins off of it. But if you want to become a channel member, I have a spreadsheet on there. We'll go take a quick look at the spreadsheet. We'll talk about the players that you can do this for the most profit, but it's only available to members. Because if everybody had access to this, then the method would be dead. But you could, of course, go and do the legwork by yourself. If you don't want to become a channel member, that's fine. But it's going to be taking advantage of the team affinity team standouts. And if you'll remember, we did a similar one of these like a week or two ago, but it's going to be dealing with the 92 overall players. Okay, so the 92 overall players is what we're looking at here. And this method is pretty simple. Essentially, all you have to do is go through and snipe all the players that you need to complete one set you'll see i went ahead and before this video i sniped all the players that i needed to complete one of this set and we'll talk about how we go and determine which one of these is the most profitable okay so you need five of the 86 to 89s you need five of the 82 to 85s and then you need 10 of the 78 to the 81 so they are pretty expensive uh to complete at the time of me buying up and sniping everything when i updated my spreadsheet 86 to 89s were about 28,000, so 140,000 for those five 82 to 85s were about 8,000, so that's about 40,000 for those five 78 to 81 you need 10 of those and they were about 3500 so about 35,000 there all together that's about 215,000 coins you should be able to snipe for a little bit less than that so let's go ahead and go look so like i said i did snipe up all the cards that i needed before this video started i did have a good number of the 78 to 81s i only had to buy two of them there so we're just going to kind of average out they were all going for 3400 so we're going to average out my total cost that i spent uh assuming i had to buy the other eight which i didn't because you know gap method and all that stuff but for the 86 to 89 i was getting them for around 27 thousand or so i had to go a little bit higher on some of these but you can see here i got this justin herbert snipe for about twenty five thousand. for the 82s to 85s they're all going for a flat 7900 again these numbers could be different when you go and do this but these are the numbers that i was able to snipe for and then 70s to 81s they were all going for 3400 at least the 70s to 79s were uh, i got about 100 of these guys if i wanted they were all going for 3400 so all together after you add up everything that i bought assuming i bought 10 of these 78 to 79 i would have spent two hundred and eight thousand three hundred and fifty coins and we were talking about earlier the prices if you didn't filter down you didn't get any size so it was going to be 215,000 again we'll take a look at that on the spreadsheet once we're done uh over here on madden and everything so the next step is the one that takes a lot of legwork and this is what you're going to be getting if you do become a member because i'll be updating this spreadsheet every other day or so like i said i do it for the 89 team standouts as well so you don't have to do it for just the 92s and also right now the calvin ridley team standout set is still pretty profitable so you might want to go and do that one if you're looking at it uh but we'll go take a look at the spreadsheet here in just a minute but we're going to look at eric wilson okay so eric wilson is one and again these numbers can fluctuate the only problem with this method is that a lot of times people are having trouble selling specifically the power-ups the power-ups sometimes take some time to sell basically what you're relying on with this method is that somebody wants to go in here and actually buy eric wilson because obviously this 92 is going for a good bit and his power-up is going for a significant amount so that is the only problem with this method it's not a quick hour turnaround a lot of times but it is very quick to go and complete the sets you can go and invest some coins in them you might have to go and re-put them up on the auction house a couple times and all that good stuff but you can see here that eric wilson is selling for 150,000 and then his power-ups are selling for about 126,000 and there's only two of each on the auction house so what I would recommend to do is if you want to use the spreadsheet you can do that find the best price the guys that are going for the most which again we'll go take a look at that in just a minute and then you're going to undercut these prices for just a little bit so I'm going to go and complete the Eric Wilson set and I'm going to put his 92 up for about 148,000 and then his power-up I'm going to put up for about 125,000 or so so after tax that is another thing that the spreadsheet calculates it gives you the best prices that you can sell the guys for after tax that's going to be about 263,000 a little bit less because i am undercutting but let's go ahead and go complete his set and we'll do that with his power up and all that good stuff and again that is the hardest part about this method is that the things don't always sell right away and if they don't don't panic yes their price might drop a little bit but if these cards were to sell for the price that i'm putting them up at i would be profiting about sixty thousand coins and it's a very very quick method let's see eric wilson is all the way down at the bottom right here and i will just let you guys know that when i made this method for the 89 overall team standouts uh the cards that i talked about specifically in there that day 
day and the day after and everything, their prices were absolutely tanked. So even if only five or 10 people went and did this specific card, it's not gonna work out because there's gonna be too many on the auction house and that will cause their price to fall. So that's why it's gonna be rotating around it. Eric Wilson isn't always gonna be the move. He's not always gonna be the guy to go do. Now, after this video comes out, there will probably be a good number of people that just saw Eric Wilson, they clicked off the video and they went to do his set. So his price probably will fall pretty significantly. What you wanna do to make coins off of this is take advantage of this set before everybody else knows about it. So again, you either go and do the legwork yourself and you go through all 32 overall team standouts and figure out which ones are selling for the most, or you can just sign up for the membership and go look at my spreadsheet there, but that is totally y'all's call. Okay, so we got the two guys. Let's go ahead and go over to our item binder. We'll put them up for auction. Yes, I might have to go re-put him up. Usually the 92s actually sell pretty easily but i'm gonna put them up for eight hours there's really no reason to put them up for just the hour uh so we'll double check and make sure you hit l1 or lb if you're on xbox 126,000 is still the lowest and you can see that 126,000 undercut that 146,000 already by a little bit so we're gonna do the same thing we're gonna walk them on up right here we're gonna put them up for about 100 we'll do about 121,000 or so so if somebody's going and looking for this Eric Wilson power up, they will buy mine because it's cheaper by a few thousand coins. No problem there. 92 overall, still 150,000 is the price point there. So I'll put this one. I think I put this one up for eight hours to power up, but we'll do the same thing for this one. We'll put them up for eight hours and we'll undercut that 150,000 by just a little bit. So assuming that these guys sell for that price, you're going to profit about 60,000 coins off of this one right there. You could easily get four of these done an hour about 250,000 coins or so every hour. That is not bad at all, but let's go ahead and go take a look at the spreadsheet. I'm just gonna show you all a little bit. I'm not gonna show you all the whole spreadsheet. This is only available to members, $5 a month if you're interested to support the channel and all that stuff and see all that where I do all the legwork. Let's go take a quick look at that, but I just want y'all to be aware before we do that, the names on here that you see that are going for a high amount, whenever you're watching this, if you're watching this a day or two after, they might not be the move anymore because the more people that watch this video, the more people are gonna go try and do it. So just a disclaimer there. All right guys, so here's the member spread that you get access to for five dollars a month you can see there's a lot of other stuff down here like cheapest training cheapest snow all that good stuff there's a couple other methods down here that you can go take a look at if you sign up but we're just taking a look at this one right now i just updated it at 10 30 a.m and this is the cost to complete over here for the team of the week guys 215,000, which we talked about earlier this is unfiltered you can usually snipe a little bit lower than this and then you go through each of these guys these are the ones that are the best value so if you're watching this video very shortly after it comes out for the noti squad and all those guys a couple hours after it comes out these are probably going to be the guys that you're going to want to go and do okay for the ones that are about 240,000 plus like that there's not a ton of them it does rotate through but you see ones like this like t higgins here he's only 157,000. t higgins tomorrow or the next day might be going for like close to 300,000. it really does rotate through a lot we saw this on the 89 overall team standouts when we made a similar video on that there's 134,000. james robinson the only thing that kind of keeps it down is when their power up is low so like brandon williams for example his power up is only 1700 because it's a pretty common power up he didn't get one for team standouts all that stuff so he will probably never be that crazy high even though his uh, 92 overall is going for 130,000, which isn't too bad but the red right here does signify that when i updated this there weren't any on the block so you can essentially name your price at that point obviously somebody will come along and undercut you at some point if you try and put them up for you know three or four hundred thousand or something stupid and people won't pay that so be aware but guys this is what you will get access to i update this at least every other day same for the 89 overall team standouts the best training the best snow prices all that good stuff uh, is what you will get access to so if you are interested that's just something that's available to y'all all right so let's end this video with a 100 000 coin giveaway it is almost christmas it's only a couple days away uh so to be entered into this giveaway tell me what you're hoping you get for christmas if you're an adult what you're going to be buying yourself for christmas and of course give me a way to contact you whether it's twitter instagram all that stuff you can also join the discord down in the description if you don't have any of those and i can contact you through that but thank y'all so much for watching y'all the mvps and as always i will see y'all in the next one